So I'll go and show you exactly how to get private browsing on your iPhone. Whether you're on iOS 15 or 16, it is essentially the same process. However, it is kind of complicated to be honest. So what we want to do is we want to make our way over to our Safari browser. You can do Safari, whatever it is. We'll be using Safari in this example. And all we want to do is go ahead and get into this little panel. So we can do this by swiping up from the top, basically just like so, and we'll get into this panel. Now under start page, which is right here, or whatever option is right here for the most part, all you want to do is click here and you'll come into this little panel. So now what you can do is you can choose whether you want to do a start page, you can choose if you want to do a new empty tab group button, or you can do click on this private browsing option. So you can click on private just right there. What's going to happen is it's going to bring you into private browsing and it's going to tell you private browsing is enabled. So now all you have to do is click the plus button. And now if you see this little black portion up there, that means you're on private browsing. If you see the tab bar is dark as well, that means you're on public or private browsing. So now anything you do here is not going to be saved in your history. So you can realistically do whatever you want to. It's if you want to, you know, sign into other accounts, if you want to watch some videos or whatever, you can do whatever you want to on this page. It works just like a regular browser, like on Safari. So you can open up more tabs. You can still add tabs this way. You can delete tabs by going up here and swiping them out of the way and all that stuff. Now, if you want to go back into standard browsing from private browsing, what you want to do is you want to go ahead and clear out of any tabs that you don't want anybody else to see. You want to go and click on the private browsing right there. And you want to go back to start page. And that's going to basically come make you bring into your public browsing option. So now you can do whatever you want to. It's going to be stored as always. You'll have your, all your accounts and everything from here. And that's pretty much how you do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That would mean so much. But definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.